Today we're going to look at automation with Excel and AutoIt. In this example, we have a network switch with ports 1, 2, 3, 4, all the way up to 48. Also in the spreadsheet are the descriptions of the ports. This is port 1 description, port 2 description, and so on. And the idea is this is documented in the Excel spreadsheet, but not yet documented in the switch itself. So we're going to generate a list of commands that can be typed in the switch based on this spreadsheet to automate this process. So what we're going to do first is go ahead and get the, um, start here on cell 1, get the auto hit script started. And now it's going to uh, navigate through each cell, copying the label to the clipboard. And once it's all um, finished, it will then save this to an external file. And as you can see, scrolling has no effect on this, and this will run until port 48. Okay, now that we're all done, we're going to reload this file, and you can kind of see these are uh, switch commands that can be um, automatically um, fed to the switch so you don't, you're not having to type all this in. Uh, let's look at uh, port 17 here. Okay, so this is port 17 right here. And what I've done uh, as per the client's request is swap around prod1 and uh, hype v5. So if we look here at interface uh, 17, we can see that hype v5 is first and then prod1, whereas in the Excel spreadsheet it's different. Um, and quickly looking at the AutoIt code, um, the AutoIt code is pretty quick, is pretty short, um, less than 50 lines of code to accomplish this.